Hey guys, it's Sonny Debbie and we're gonna juice half a gallon of orange juice using this manual juicer because we don't have an electric one. <laughs> but we've been using this for years and we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and put it in this glass jug. It's a half gallon jug that's you know airtight, which is pretty awesome. So we're gonna be basically cutting all these oranges into quarters and juicing them a quarter each of these quarters into them with this manual squeezer or this manual juicer. And it takes about a good 30 seconds per quarter. So we have roughly around 30-ish um, car car oranges that are a pretty good size we got from the uh, grocery store. We It was on sale, so we bought a whole bag of it. Actually, it was actually a wholesale that we bought it and it was a lot. So we couldn't eat all of it. So they started going super, super um, saturated and super sweet too. So we figured we don't have enough space in the refrigerator. So the best thing to do is to juice them all. So we have around 30 uh, car car oranges, we start juicing them. And that's really about how much it takes to make half a gallon of orange juice, about 30 oranges or so, or roughly two dozen oranges. Uh, but yeah, if you're planning to do this on your own, if you want to build up your wrist strength and your finger strength, I, yeah, you could totally use this manual method. And after a while, it's, um, after about halfway through, you're, you're kind of wondering if you have, actually have an electric juicer at this point. But at the same time, it does smell really good and it's also very satisfying to juice all these things. But, you know, I would suggest using this juicer more for, you know, if you're gonna be, you know, juicing limes or like a few of these, like let's say under 10, anything more than 10, you know, you should probably get an electric juicer. But if you don't, and you don't want to take up that plant space, this will work too. It just takes a little longer. So it took us a total of about, I think 30 minutes to juice all 30 something um, uh, oranges. So I started eating some of the car car oranges um, flesh while we were doing halfway because I felt it was a total waste to actually not eat the, um, the meat of the, of, of the, or the pulp of the oranges. So. So you can see we're pretty much done. And there was also some mandarin, um, small tiny little mandarin oranges we had too. So we, I juiced them too. Those kind of fit into the equation, but not really. They offered very little juice, but they were really sweet and super sour at the same time. So we decided to just put them in. Makes it taste really good. This orange juice is really, really nice. Um, fresh squeezed orange juice is always much better than some concentrated stuff. There's no water added, it's all orange juice, and that's what's really cool and rewarding about juicing this, you know, fresh. So, as you can see, <laughs> I think um, this was like about 20 minutes in, or 20 or 20 something minutes in, and we were almost done. And afterwards, definitely wash everything, otherwise things rust, so we rinse and wash this thing. This thing's been, you know, we've been using this for decades because they, it works so well. And once you get one, you really don't need any more. It's good for drinks and other stuff. This Pyrex uh, measuring um, cup is actually very good too. It's 64 ounces, very, very useful. That's half. That's roughly half a gallon. So we actually sealed it with this airtight container that's glass. So, you know, we didn't want to use any plastic stuff and it also looks very really cool. beautiful. The fact that it's airtight and it's lockable too. Very, very cool. And anyways, that's really about it. Like I said, if you want to you know, use a manual juicer and don't want all the appliances in your room, in your kitchen, definitely use a manual one and you know manual squeezing uh, juicer. But if you have a lot like this and you do a lot of juicing, get a juicer. It, it makes your life a lot easier. Anyways, guys, this is Julian W. I hope this review was helpful to you. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.